Hey everybody, today we'll be looking at the solo of John Mayer's Belief and it sounds like this. <laughs> What's up everybody, my name is Simone from Your Guitar Academy. In today's guitar lesson we'll be looking at Belief by John Mayer and we'll be looking at the solo today. So just before we start guys, don't forget that you can check all the other videos that we upload on YouTube, subscribing to our channel and you will find also the guitar lesson for all the other parts of this song. Alright guys, so we are ready to start. We'll try to break it down the solo in different sections, in different parts. Let's get started saying that we are in the key of D minor and the first thing that you are going to play it's a slide between the 13th and the 15th fret on the B string to reach the D, so to reach the root note. You're going to play this with a, sl with a slide by, uh, with three fingers using the ring finger and a huge vibrato on it. Like this. Then we are going to get into the uh, position 1 to the shape 1 of the uh, D minor pentatonic scale on the 10th fret and we'll be doing this with a slide back with the 3 fingers using the ring finger to the 12th fret very quickly twice and the second time you also do a pull off to listen to the sound of the 10th fret of the G string like, like this. So basically if I put together this beginning it's going to be That's what happens in the first little part of this solo. The second phrase is this. Now, how do we do this? We are, as we said, in the first shape of the uh, minor pentatonic scale in D minor. We are going to play a bending with the third finger on the 12th fret of the G string. Very short. Then you're going to play 10 13th on the B string. And then back to 10. Then bending again on the same 12th release, tent on the G string and then this which is going to be a sweep picking on the 12th 12th of the D and A string sliding back to the 10th uh, fret of the A string so slowly once you've done this first slide between the 10th and the uh, sorry between the 12th and the 10th fret on the A string you repeat the slide very quickly twice like this so all together is going to be And then you play with the first finger at the end of these slides, uh, the 8th fret of the A string, and then you play which is 10 to 8 on the A string with a pull off, then slide into, into the 12 with the ring finger again on the A string, then 10, 12 on the D string, 10 on the G string doing a quarter bend, going down possibly, just to bend a little bit this note, and then uh, so the last two notes are just 12, 10 on the D string. So this little part that we are playing now is... Okay, so if I put all together these uh, sections that we are just playing right now, it's going to be slide, slide back twice, pull off. Then phrase with the bending, sweep picking doing the first um, slide back, slide twice again, eight, then phrase with the uh, pull off, and the slides, right, and we end this here, then what, what are we going to play? We are going to move in this area of the neck and we are going to do 5 to 7 three times with a, a sort of very quick hammer on, but we also have to say that the sound is staccato, so it's very short, and only at the end of the third time, on the fourth sixteenth of that video, we're going to play the C on the fifth fret of the G string again, like before you do this slide back with the ring finger on the D string doing 7 to 5th then 5th to 3rd is a pull off and then 5th on the A string which is again the root note so like slowly like this then once you are here we are basically in the shape 3 in D minor here what are we gonna do is basically 3rd and 5th fret with the same hammer-ons so after this we play the same hammer-ons on 3rd and 5th fret of the D string 3 times 
but this time we are going to do a sort of uh, three times hammer on, then slide uh, forward and backwards on the sixth fret to play the blue note of this pentatonic, and then fifth to third with a pull off, ending here very short with the sound like. As you can see, all the only fingers I'm using here, I'm coming closer, is going to be just first and third fingers. Okay, once you are here, you're going to play three times these two notes together, the 14th fret on the G string and the 13th fret on the B string, like, like this. The first one is something that you're going to get with a huge slide. Okay. Then the next two short phrases are going to be, first of all, which means still back on the shape one of the D minor pentatonic, you're going to play 12 on the A, 10, 12 on the D, so 10 on the G, bending on the, on the G uh, 12 string, 12 fret, and then 12, 10, 12 on the G string again. Again, even this one a bit closer. So after that, the last phrase that you're going to have is going to be at the bottom two strings of the first shape in D minor, and it's like... and slide. So it's 10, 13, 10, 13 with a bending, then, then 13 on the B, then 10 twice and slide back. Again, slowly, I'll come closer even here. And you come back. So if I do now the whole solo really slowly a couple of times so that you can try to play along with me, you start with a slide then you move here slower than this like Alright guys, so this is pretty much everything you need for this guitar solo. Don't forget guys that you can click in the link in the description here below and you will head to our website where you can find the full write-up for free of this lesson and that will help you to follow this video even better. 